What's up guys, Joey here with DaVinci Trades. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be showing you how to stake your Ethereum on your Ledger device. So if you're liking these how-to videos, go ahead and smash that like button and a sub is always appreciated. Let's get started. As always, the first thing we do is hook up our Ledger to our computer. Go ahead and enter our pin. Allow Ledger Live to manage your device, double click. In Ledger Live, we'll go ahead and find Ethereum and then go to the right side and click install. You'll see a loading please wait screen on your Ledger device. Awesome, you've just installed the Ethereum app on your Ledger device, now click Add Account. From here, we'll grab our Ledger device and double click to open the Ethereum app. Ledger Live will begin synchronizing your account. After it's synchronized, go ahead and click Add Account. Alrighty, great job. You've successfully added your account to your Ledger device. Now go ahead and click Done. Now on the Accounts tab of Ledger Live, go ahead and click Ethereum. Click Receive. Click Continue. Now from here, we want to grab our Ledger device and verify the address that's on the screen with the address that's shown on our Ledger device. So go ahead and click the Right button. Confirm that this is the right address. Before you navigate any further on your Ledger, go ahead and copy the address on your screen. Now we're going to navigate over to your favorite exchange. Today we're going to be using Coinbase because it is one of the most common exchanges used by beginners. You don't have to use Coinbase for this step. You can use a bunch of other exchanges like Gemini, KuCoin, Binance. The process is basically the same for all these exchanges. Now I'm going to assume that you already have some Ethereum in your account. If not, that's perfectly okay. Go ahead and purchase some. You can use an ACH transaction from your bank, a wire transfer, or a credit or debit card. Once you have the Ethereum in your account, go to the top right corner and click Send and Receive. Now on the send side, make sure it says pay with Ethereum, and then on the to section, go ahead and paste that wallet address that we copied from Ledger Live. For the sake of this video, I'm going to click send all, click continue, click send now. You may have to go through a two-step verification process, go ahead and open up the Authenticator app on your mobile device, and then click confirm. Alrighty, you're doing great. You just sent over your Ethereum from your Coinbase account over to your Ledger device. We're going to go ahead and click Done. Navigate back over to Ledger Live. If you're still on the screen, go ahead and grab your Ledger device, put in your PIN code again, and then navigate to the right side using the right button, and then double click to confirm the address. Go ahead and click Done. And as you can see, we've successfully transferred our Ethereum from our Coinbase account over to our Ledger device. Now, if you don't see your Ethereum just yet, it's perfectly okay. You may just have to wait a few minutes. Once the Ethereum is populated into your account, we're gonna go to the top and we're gonna click Stake. Now from here, you have two choices. You can either stake directly with Lido or you can get a 3.09% discount by buying staked ETH on one inch rather than staking directly with Lido. So for the sake of this video, we're gonna go ahead and do both. We'll go ahead and start with one inch. 
I'm gonna go ahead and click max. And then I'm gonna go ahead and cut that in half. So as you can see, I have 0.1 ETH. I'm gonna go ahead and make 0.05. I'm gonna click swap. Click confirm swap. Now, before we sign this transaction, obviously you guys can see that the network fees are above 10% of the amount, which is absolutely insane. So I'm going to sign this transaction regardless for the sake of this video. You guys are worth it. Um, you might want to try this at a different time when there's less congestion in the market and you might have better odds. If you guys would like, go ahead and skip to the next part of the video where we use Lido to stake. You're not going to hurt my feelings. Just keep in mind, I'm not sure if the network fees are going to be any different than they are now. With that said, go ahead and grab your ledger device and put in your pin code. Click continue. Give it a few seconds and Ledger Live is going to install the one inch app on your device real quick. Once you see open app one inch on your Ledger device, go ahead and double click. On our Ledger device, we're going to go ahead and review the transaction. Right click. We'll confirm that this is a swap. Navigate to the end where it says accept and send and double click. And congratulations, you've successfully swapped your Ethereum to staked Ethereum. Now, if you get a transaction error code, it's probably because the network fees have changed. You'll just have to run through this process once again. Click close. Now, it may take a second, but if you look in your accounts page and underneath your Ethereum account, you'll see that you have Lido staked ETH. Now, we're going to go ahead and stake directly through Lido. Click your Ethereum account. Go to stake. Close and proceed. Click max. Click submit. Click continue. This may take a second depending on the congestion on the network. Your transaction may go through before mine does or vice versa. Alrighty, congratulations. The staking operation was successful. Go ahead and click the X. We'll go back to our accounts and we'll click Lido Staked ETH. I never really figured out how to pronounce it, whether it was Lido or Lido. I think Lido sounds cooler. We'll go with that. And that's it, guys. You're now earning around 4% APR on your staked Ethereum. I hope this video helped you guys out. And if you want to see more how-to videos like this one, go ahead and subscribe to our channel and smash that like button for me. We'll see you next time on DaVinci Trades. Thank you, guys.